Here's how to fix your account has been disabled in the App Store. Now, if you're in the App Store, you're trying to download install apps, or you're just messing around on your phone and it says your account has been disabled, there are a few different steps you can go through to get that fixed. So it might look something like this. It says your account has been disabled in the App Store and iTunes. And this usually happens when you go in and you try to download and install an app and you enter that password in too many times incorrectly. It might temporarily disable your account or permanently disable your account if you don't go through these steps. So let's hop out of here and we will hop into settings. And the first thing we'll do is tap on our name at the very top. Now at the very bottom, you can see is a sign out button. Let's tap that sign out button. You're gonna enter in your iTunes or iCloud password again, and basically log out of your iCloud. If you don't know your password, the key here is just hit this forgot password. It will pop up with the ability to enter your phone password, and then it'll text you a code to your phone number or email address. Basically, it'll walk you through steps to get you to so that you know that iCloud password to be able to log out. After you go through all those steps, you're gonna just log back into your Apple ID or your iCloud. And by going through that process of logging out and logging in, you verify to Apple that you are the owner of that account. If you still have issues with it being disabled, let's hop out of here and basically this web page says, if a message says your account has been disabled, you can always just contact Apple support. So let's tap on contact support and you can see you can go directly to getsupport.apple.com. So at the very bottom there, getsupport.apple.com and you can choose to chat with them in a text message or you can choose to call them either one basically reach out to apple they'll help you get your account basically recovered and not disabled anymore they'll walk you through steps of verifying your identity and that you actually own that account but after that your account will be recovered and won't have any issues hope this helps if you have any questions on that leave them in the comments down below and i'll catch you on the next one